Hi, I'm Christine Ortiz. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever seen a carnivorous animal feeding on nectar? There are a few small carnivores that do it, like this mongoose, but for the first time a large carnivore has been documented doing so. This is an Ethiopian wolf, with scientists so feeding on the nectar of the red hot poker flower. Normally, we think of insects as feeding on nectar, and by doing so, they become covered in pollen. When they move from one flower to another, they spread the pollen, allowing pollination. It turns out these wolves also pollinate, as their snouts become coated with pollen as they lick the flowers. They can lick up to 30 flowers in just one visit to a field, moving pollen between flowers and acting as pollinators. Back in 2015, scientists identified four carnivores as pollinators, but those were all small mammals. The wolf is now the largest known pollinator. Also, different packs of wolves visited these areas in Ethiopia full of red hot poker flowers, and they brought their pups along, passing the knowledge on to the next generation. So, have we missed more examples of animals that feed on nectar? Or are animals changing their habits to adapt to new situations? Sandra Lai is a senior scientist at the Ethiopian Wolf Conservation Program. She said, these findings highlight just how much we still have to learn about one of the world's most threatened carnivores. They also demonstrate the complexity of interactions between different species living on the beautiful roof of Africa.